I welcome all into the seventh part of equal triangles. Please listen the question. In the figure below, O is the center of the circle and A, B, C are points on the circle. What are the angles of triangle A, B, C? Students, this is the figure given in the question. Now look at the data. O is the center of the circle. A, B, C are three points of the circle. And also angle B, O, C. Sorry, angle B, O, A is 120 degree. Angle C, O, A is 120 degree. Okay. Now, can you find out what is angle B, O, C? Angle B, O, C? How do we find angle B, O, C? Do you know about angles around a point? Yes, angles around a point added up to 360. Suppose if this is a point and angle is 60 degree, what will be this angle? And this is a point, angle around a point. It is 360, sum is 360. 360 minus 60, so this angle will be 300 degree. Okay. Now, here, what is angle BOC? Sum is 360. So, 360 minus, add these two angles. 360 minus of 120 plus 120. So, let's do it. Angle BOC equals... 360 minus adding these two angles 120 plus 120 okay this is equals 360 minus what is 120 plus 120 it is 240 then subtract 360 minus 240 0, 6 minus 4, 2, 3 minus 2, 1. It is 120 degree. That is angle BOC is 120 degree. Okay. Now look at triangle BOC. What about the sides? B O and C O. These sides are radii of the circle and radii are equal. So B O and C O are equal in length. So what type of triangle is B O C? If two sides are equal means the triangle is isosceles. If this triangle is isosceles, what is the peculiarity? Angle opposite to equal sides are equal. Here OB and OC are equal. So opposite angle. OB opposite angle is angle C. And OC opposite angle is angle B. So angle B and angle C are equal. So we have to find angle B and angle C. So here angle B equals angle C equals. What is sum of angles of a triangle? It is 180. So 180 minus sum is 180 minus these two angles are equal. So 180 minus one of the angle, angle O is given. So 180 minus 120 
Since these two angles are equal, to find each angle, you have to divide this by 2. So, 180 minus 120, it is, subtract, 0 minus 0, 0, 8 minus 2, 6, 1 minus 1, 0. So, 60 by 2. 60 divided by 2, it is 30 degree. It shows angle B is 30 degree, angle C also 30 degree. So, you can mark here, angle O, B, C, 30 degree, angle O, C, B, 30 degree. Our question is, what are the angles of triangle A, B, C? To get angles of triangle A, B, C, we have to find out angles of triangle O, B, A and angles of triangle O, C, A. Okay. So, same procedure. Here one angle is 120. Here also OB, OA are two radii of the circle. So these two lengths are equal. So triangle OBA is an isosceles triangle. So that angles opposite to equal angles are equal. So same way if this angle is 120, other two angles we have already found 30 each. Here also it will be same way you will find out 30 degree. Here also 30 degree. Triangle OCA. OA and OC are radii of this circle. So triangle OCA is an isosceles triangle because OA and OC are equal. So angles opposite to Equal sides are equal. So, these two angles are also equal. Same way you will find out. Angle OAC is 30 degree. Also, angle OCA is also 30 degree. Okay. So, what are angles of triangle ABC? In triangle ABC, look at the figure. In triangle ABC, angle A equals 30 plus 30. 30 plus 30, it is 60 degree. Okay. Angle B equals, look at here, 30 degree plus 30 degree. 30 plus 30, it is also 60 degree. Again, angle C. 30 plus 30, 30 degree plus 30 degree, it is again 60 degree. All angles of triangle ABC are equal, so this triangle is an equilateral triangle. Can you wind up the class now? Practice these problems well. See you again with another part of bisectors. Thank you.